Hello, this is my Heteroscadra Maculata, the Togo Starburst Baboon. Uh, this one originates from the west coast of Africa. This one's considered an arboreal, so they definitely prefer to be up in the trees versus on the ground. Uh, this one's just a little sling, so right now they don't feel like they have to be up in the trees. So this one just gets a simple little deli cup, since it's so tiny. Just a half inch sling. They are highly defensive, very fast, and have potent venom. So this is another tarantula that should be respected. Definitely not handled, unless you just like to take risks. Um, these grow up to be about five inches in leg span, but they do have kind of a stocky build to them. So they're pretty impressive looking. Uh, they do prefer a little bit of a higher humidity level, uh, like most arboreals do. Uh, as for temperature, just keep it, you know, comfortable as much as you're comfortable. Uh, when they're this young, they're not very impressive to look at because they're just kind of a drab, dark gray color. But when they grow older, they'll develop these really impressive looking patterns on their bodies. Um, the females especially will be vibrant white with black markings all over the body. And the males will be darker color, but still have the markings that will look very impressive. So these are definitely teased to respect. Uh, this one's lightning quick already at this young age. So, I'm going to offer it a cricket and see if it's interested. And again, what I usually do uh, to hydrate this sling, I'll just uh, spray mist the enclosure. And that way it can drink at its leisure off of the edges of the enclosure and the substrate. So, I'm having to keep one eye on what I'm doing, getting the cricket out in the other eye, watching the tarantula to make sure it doesn't escape. that? I know you can get it if you want it. I slightly maimed it so that way it won't jump out of the shallow enclosure here. Well, with the antenna moving, I'm surprised the tarantula hasn't uh, caught the cricket yet. This one's eaten for me on camera before, but can be camera shy. There you go. Glad I can finally feed another tarantula. Heteroscadra maculata. Togo starburst baboon. Very good attack. So when it uh, gets a little older, I'm going to put it in a in arboreal enclosure. Which means it will be vertical. And I'll give it some wood or fake plants to climb on. But for now, it just gets a little delicate since it's just a little half inch sling. Alright, well, you enjoy that. Alright, thanks.